saw her go down her back. Girl, you need a plaque. Cause you the baddest I done seen in a while, and that's a fact. Ooh. Look at that. Yes. That's just how I'm living. Money and pretty women. Honey and fit. That's all I'm getting. Hey, y'all. It's all of Destiny. In this video, I'll be blow drying, straightening, and curling my natural hair. I'll link my most recent wash day routine down below since my hair is already prepped for this process. It's been a minute since I straightened my hair. December 2020 to be exact. Let's get into it. This is what I like. This is what I like. I posted to my Instagram story saying that I've been trying to find songs, right? To do a reel with, right? But everybody's sending me hairstyle ideas. I was like, y'all, I needed a song suggestion or a popular reel create this one suggestion. Not the hairstyle. Because I already know the hairstyle I'm about to do. And since I'm about to straighten my hair in the summertime, I'm feeling like I should do the girl don't do what it's not worthy. Since usually people don't straighten their natural hair in the summer because you're gonna sweat it out. Look how I said that you're gonna sweat it out. So I feel like that'll be a cool one. One of my subscribers shot, ooh, <laughs> natural, natural, natural Lista. Let me show y'all how she got it. Had to hit them with them. Mm hmm. Y'all see that focus? Mm hmm. So yeah, she just sent me an actual real to my DM. And I'm looking at it like, who told you I was gonna straighten my hair? <laughs> Cause that's what the lady doing. So I'm just like, who told you? Like, let me send her a message back. I'm gonna send a video reply actually. Who told you I was gonna straighten my hair? Like, who told you? I'm gonna start sending y'all random video replies. Cause I know y'all would like this. <laughs> she gonna be like, what? I just sent her a video reply. So I wanna do this one. I'm not gonna do it, girl. I was just thinking about it. I'm not gonna do it. I did it. All right, so I'm putting this robe on because I need to be two people. I mean, obviously you can see that, but you watch it too hard. Girl, don't do it, girl. Girl, don't do it. It's not worth it. I guarantee you somebody gonna be talking to me about heat damage and all of that. <laughs> don't do it, girl. It's not worth it. I did it. Instagram reels go this way. Be right back. No caller ID. I don't like this. Hello? Yes, this is Destiny. Who's calling? Awesome. I'm doing well. How are you? The majority of people who have a negative viewpoint of you really don't even know you. People's opinion of you is none of your business, nor should you make it yours. You, you get in a lot of trouble worrying about what somebody think about you, when really, what difference do it make? The majority of people who have a negative viewpoint of you really don't even know you. So I'll be using a heat protectant. Whether your hair is relaxed or natural, you definitely want to use one of these. Um, I'll have the products that I'm using specifically in the description box down below. And I'll be using my Red by Kiss blow dryer as well as the Red by Kiss detangler comb attachment. Helps me to get my hair blown out. It makes the flat ironing process go a little bit quicker and smoother. I'm going to take the Lux Locks Pina Colada Leave-In and apply that to each section before I begin blow drying. So each blow dry section has heat protector and leave-in conditioner on it. I'm going to use my fingers to distribute that and also finger detangle. If you always lose things when you're doing your hair, comment down below. I know somebody can relate. <laughs> so I'm just going to spray more of that heat protector on there and then I began blow drying each section. These videos are sped up and this video is nicely edited for your viewing pleasure. But I guarantee you this took me probably like an hour and a half in real time. I just want to put that out there. On some sections, I did choose to blow dry my hair on cool versus using heat. Um, just to kind of get it straightened out. Take your time. Blow dry your hair in small sections. Try to get it as straight as you can with the blow dryer. It'll help you to save time when you begin the straightening process. Yes, I'm going in with more heat protector because why not? Look at that length. I know you see, I know you see it. I know you see it. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and plug up my new me power couple flat iron. And immediately when I plug it up, I basically just take a cotton pad with some alcohol and I wipe it down. Wipe me down. I don't, I don't wipe me down. Go away. Money out of game. same straightening iron I use on my wig so I forgot to turn it down um so yeah I'm just gonna apply some serum to my hair as well this isn't really like a silk press I think when people do silk presses they kind of just straighten their hair without using any products 
Uh, that's not really the way I like to do mine. So you're going to see me reaching for some products, baby. Just do whatever works for you because that's definitely what I'm going to do. And it rhymes. Ooh. So I want to straighten my hair out first and then I'm going to curl it. And to really lock the curl in place, I'll be adding a flexi rod on there. That way my hair can kind of like cool in a set position and then I won't have to reach for the flat iron or a curling iron every day to put these curls back. The chasing comb that you see me using is by Numi as well. Look at that length, baby. Period. <laughs> if you saw the video where my sister bone straightened my hair in December of 2020, then you're here for the length. You're here for the length, chick. I know. I know. It grew. I know you see it. I know. See, somebody gonna act like they don't see it, but I know you see. Okay, let me stop. Let me keep up with the voiceover. Taking some more serum. Um, I'm going to be using the heat protectant, that serum, and the chasing comb on every section that I do. Period. Yes, I'm home. I definitely can't come over your house today because I just get on my deal. Yeah, you can. I'm here. Let me tell your mom Okay. Mom, I see Pete. Mom, take me out there today. I would love to. Yes, sir. Do you want to drink on the you get in the pool today? Yes, you know I know how to jump out of my pool. That's all day. Is it? This looks so good. I just kind of want to see it. This is a quick comparison of what we have so far, but let's keep going. She hear you. She don't like it, but she hear you. My hair has gotten so long. Like... And the fact that my ends still look like this from the last time my sister trimmed them. <laughs> Your fave could never. Like, never. She wish she could. She really wish she could do what I do. I ain't new to this. I'm true to this. I do this. It's a difference. Say, it's a difference. <laughs> now you tell somebody to say something and they actually say it. Trips me out every time. Yeah. I'm trying to just straighten this side just to see it straight. Then I was going to curl it at the end. She would and did. I did not say nothing about no side chick. I said your fave. Your favorite girl. She can't do what I do. That's what I said. <laughs> do you know what that means? What? Keep playing with me. See where it gets you. Far. All right. What we got to say for noise tacos, y'all? Put it in the comments down below. Because somebody playing with me right now. Don't even say it because I know you finna quote that song you like. Yeah, I hate it. I'm really almost done. That's what's crazy. And I'm taking big sections. Oh, my hair has gotten so long. Oh, my goodness. I would have never knew it when it's in its natural state. Shrinkage is so real. This naturally blown out. It's like half the length of this. That's wild. That's so wild. And I will not be working out while my hair is straight. I just won't. <laughs> I just won't. <sighs> Pray for me in the weather. When I like reposition the comb, I try not to put it where it was already at, if that makes sense. And then I just try to keep going down. Wow. That's crazy. I did like, I literally did the last. So I did the last clip for Instagram, for my Instagram story, and I forgot to press record. But y'all were seeing me do it anyways. I didn't realize that I really hadn't shown you all the length when I was kind of like straightening and curling this side. So I did kind of just leave this side straight. I had been seeing like pictures of people with their hair kind of like curled a bit. So I was like, I kind of want it straight but curled. Cause normally I wear it straight, then I curl it if it gets a little bit frizzy just to maintain it. Yeah. Y'all kind of can see it more than me cause I broke my mirror and I haven't bought a new one yet. I'm probably gonna use my pressing comb on the front or maybe just my edge control. We'll lay that down. This looks so good. I can't grab it yet. <laughs> Bra strap. 
I want to say I'm proud of armpit length. Alright, so I'm going to just turn the flat iron down even more from where it was. There aren't any numbers. Um, it just says 140, and then as you kind of twist, the last number you see is 450, so I just kind of guesstimated. But since my hair is already straight and I just need a little bit of the heat to make it curl, uh, I just went ahead and turned it down. And I forgot to do serum on this entire side, so now while I'm curling it, that's when I'm going to put the serum on there. And this just helps to kind of sift silk it a bit and make it actually hold what I'm about to do to it. When I take more in the beginning, it's like less than I would need during the week. That's my method. If you like the way my hair turns out, then just do, do the same thing. So I put the flat iron behind the hair, kind of twist and kind of over twist. Then that's when you kind of pull and twist again. Keep pulling and twisting. If you need to kind of do it like that to loosen it up some, do that and then let it out. I think I lost the end. So I lost the end, which means the ends is still basically just straight. So to keep from doing the whole thing over, I'm just going to only take it on the end and just bump it. And then you're going to get something like this. But in order for this to hold and it doesn't like flop, it's important to kind of go from hot to cool. And that's where the flexi rod comes in handy. If not a flexi rod, whatever you want to use to personally hold your curls, if you want to kind of pin them, uh, you can do that with like the hair pins. You can use soft rollers. I saw Catherine Bedell. She kind of, when I saw her hair too, that's what really just had me like, oh my God, that's so pretty. Um, when she straightened her hair out, I think it was her maintenance video. So I was like, oh, it's like super cute. And I just hadn't really straightened my hair out in a while. So I was like, I'm going to do it. Girl, I'm not going to do it. I'm just thinking about it. I'm not going to do it. <laughs> That's the Instagram reel I decided to go with. So by the time y'all see this, that wouldn't be on my Instagram if y'all want to show us some love. But you really can't mess these kinds of curls up. Oh, I need more purple ones. Since my hair is a little longer, it'll keep it from being too, too, too tight. Roll the ends over itself. Uh, make sure it's smooth. Kind of fold the roller over to lock it in place. I think I'm gonna take a few of the purple ones and move them. So just take another big size section, brush it out. Take the flat iron, which should be turned down a little bit more since the hair is already straight. You're just needing the heat to help you when you put the flexi rod in it. Cause just putting flexi rods in your hair after straightening it, unless your hair is still hot, it's not gonna do anything. If you give it a head start by using the flexi rod for the heat, not the flexi rod, using the flat iron, or you can use a curling iron for this part that'll help you out and then just let it cool so i have somewhere to be in about an hour uh probably not gonna do a lot of makeup today just because wednesday is the big day not today depending on when i upload this y'all probably will know by now um the reason that i wanted to straighten out my hair and just kind of do like a cute look is because i close on my home on wednesday and i may want to take pictures i may want to celebrate i just want to look good so that's that Back to the music. off my contact this one got a little bit of makeup on it i want to rinse it off real quick i hate trying to take these out after my makeup is done yeah i see it oh i see it on there try to make sure i can see clearly before doing my lashes and mascara all of that i don't think i'm going to do bottom mascara because today is a big day and if any tears fall you know sometimes mascara will say waterproof this and that I'm not going to chance it. I'm only going to do it on the top. And I don't know where my lashes are. Well, I do know where my lashes are. I don't have a fresh pair to put on today. The rest are all kind of mixed up. I don't know what's what. Um, I'm going to just put on the same jewelry that I always wear. These are my gold earrings. In case you're new here, my parents got me these for, I want to say, two years ago on Christmas. 21st birthday gift. I'm 20. Oh, 20. You can't say you're 20. Nothing now. I'm 30 now. <laughs> And then, um, hopefully, I don't know the order of my vlogs. I'm still behind on a lot, so bear with me if I post some stuff and y'all like, what? Because y'all do remember I did misplace an SD card at one point, so 
once I get that back, y'all really gonna be seeing some old stuff. I gotta catch up. Also, just wearing my YSL bracelet, gifted to me by my mom on my 30th birthday. So the liner that I'm currently loving, the background is kind of empty. We've been packing. Um, this one is by my one of my subscribers, actually, Gorgeous Madam on Instagram. Really, really. Why did I not bring a mirror in here? Really love it. I'm gonna just use the viewfinder. Hold on. Sometimes I like to stand up and get ready. Cause I just. I don't know. I just do. I didn't stand up and do my makeup though. I sit in the film room and do it. So to avoid freeze, I'm gonna take some of this tea tree oil. Natural hair, for whatever reason, when you kinda get outside, if you don't put enough oil, and I'll put a picture up to show you all, cause I know people like their hair really silky, but the reality of that, when you're natural, you need something to kinda maintain and withstand the moisture in the air, or just like the humidity and it being hot and all of that, which is why I just, I was hesitant to even straighten my hair in the first place. 1202. But the oil will help my hair once I get outside to not puff back up on me. This is not a less is more situation. This is like a put a whole bunch just to be sure. And I was going to say show. For show, show. Alrighty, I got to make a few stops before we go to the closing. So I don't want to do too much. I'm trying to decide if I want it in my face or if I want to lay my edges. If it's in your face, I normally don't lay my edges because... It just doesn't need it. Oh, I hope this hold up. I'll do a little bit more later. We look cute for the closing, baby. I could have done the wig, but I was like, I'm gonna wear my natural hair. Straight out, make it look cute. It's giving. I'm kind of going under, not pulling all the way through. Just kind of pulling the hair down a bit. And shaking it a bit. So at the root, pulling up. Root up. And then when you start doing like this, that's what really makes it move, basically, because you're, you know, fluffing like that. A little bit of frizz is fine, but to lose the curls completely, like on the picture I put on the screen, we don't want that. <laughs> and that's what happened to me the first day, but I also had to go to the final walkthrough that same day. So I didn't really let the roller sit as long as I could have, which also played a part in it. But they've been in my hair uh, overnight now, so we're good. Love it. Love it. Some people may not like it, but that's not important to me because I love it. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Look at that. Yes. Okay, so let's get into the outfit details. My dress is from Shein, my bag is YSL, and I'm wearing my Gianni Bini sandals from Dillard's. I think Macy's has them as well. I'll link everything that's linkable down below. Questions and comments, be sure to leave all of that down below as well. If you plan on straightening out either your relaxed or natural hair, tag me on Instagram so I can repost you to my story, and I will talk to you all in my next upload.